three stocks trading below dollar 3.14 that could bounce back in 2019. I may be a week late to the pie. Naturally, stocks trading this low are there for a reason. They're mostly broke, there hasn't been a lot of love for the meal kit provider since it went public at $10 nearly two years ago. It obviously didn't. Blue Apron has been scaling back on its marketing costs in this cutthroat niche, but it's also out of its more lucrative customers. The number of family analysts see sales turning around next year, but that goalpost keeps moving further out with every rough quarter. Investors are still, the market hasn't taken a shine to peer-to-peer -peer lending the way it has with home sharing and ride sharing services, and that's resulted in Lending Club shedding more than 80% of its value since hitting the market at $1.15 in late 2014. It obviously hasn't been an easy road for Lending Club investors, and it hasn't helped that Lending Club has run into regulatory hiccups and lost its CEO to AA. Lending Club's platform continues to grow in popularity. Loan Originations The world of low-priced stocks isn't exclusively a cesspool of sinking stocks. Avon Products You're not alone if you think that Avon isn't as relevant as it was decades ago. Avon itself is, Wall Street sees revenues starting to grow again next year, and even after nearly doubling this year, the stock is trading at just 14.6 times next year's projected profit and a mere 8.6 if we go out to 2021. A lot is natural, has no position in any of the stocks mentioned. The Motley Fool has 10 stocks we like better than Avon products. When investing geniuses David and Tom Gardner have a stock tip, it can pay to listen. After all, David and Tom just revealed what they believe are the for investors to buy right now, and Avon products wasn't one of them. That's right they think, not scientifically valid. Results are up to Smoking no cooking the hot bar. I get fucking on your bitch, yeah, that, that, that. Looking up, open the park pot.